So one of my favorite features of a healthy passion is the ability to track every recipe in my fitness pal using a special code. And this is really cool because not only are you able to literally save so much time by just typing a code in versus typing every single ingredient in, you're able to eat, eat real food recipes, which I love versus what I call ingredients. When you sit there and you type in every single ingredient to make a meal. So here's how to do it. I'm going to go ahead and share my screen with you guys and show you exactly how to take advantage of this awesome feature. Okay, so you're going to first go to your Healthy Passion account. Now, I'm underneath my user settings, so I'm just going to click the search bar here. You can search a couple of ways. You can search, first of all, by clicking recipes, which will pull recipe recommendations based on your desires, your needs, your goals, etc. Or you can use a search. I'm going to use a search right now just to kind of show you guys how it works. And then what you're going to do is type in a word. So say you want chicken or broccoli or salmon or instant pot or breakfast or the search terms are they go on and on, but I'm going to use an example of chicken. So then what the software will do is it'll pull recipes that it thinks you'll like to eat, include chicken. And then what you can do is you can scroll through and you can see the nutrition information. You can see a little description. You can see a pretty picture, which is all I really care about. And when you see something you like, then you'll just go ahead and click on it. So this instant pot chicken salad with lettuce cups looks awesome. I'm going to click that. Okay. So then what you're going to do is you're going to scroll down and where you see recipe, this little tag, and you're gonna see a number here, AHP 635. So then what you're gonna do is go to My Fitness Pal, and you're gonna go ahead and plug it into whatever meal you're eating it. So I'm gonna have it for lunch. All you're gonna do is type in AHP, and then leave a space, this is key, 635. So if you can't find it in My Fitness Pal, most of the time you forgot to leave the space. Then you're just gonna click Search, and it's gonna pull up the recipe. You're just gonna click Add to Food Diary, and there you go. Now, the one thing that's not included in our recipes when they're tracked to MyFitnessPal is the pantry items. So things like olive oil, things like honey. Um, the reason we do that is because if you're kind of close on macros and you maybe need to cut down the fat a little bit, you can cut down the olive oil amount in the recipe. So I'm just gonna use a little bit of olive oil in here. Let's see, I probably already have it. Of course I don't. Um, we'll call it butter, same thing. Um, and I'm gonna use a half tablespoon here. So we'll add that in to track the pantry items. But again, way better than tracking the six or seven ingredients that's in that recipe. Another cool feature when it comes to tracking and macros is our new macro search feature. So if you want to use that, say, for example, you need specific macros to meet your goals, you're just going to click, again, the search button. And then you'll see this right here where it says carbs, protein, and fat. You'll plug in what you need. So say I need 60 grams of carbs. I need 40 grams of fat, 10 grams of protein. What the software will do, I'll hit enter. Uh, the software will actually pull through our database and pull the recipe that's closest to what you're looking for and then list it in order from there. So this is a recipe that's closest to what I'm searching for. It has 52 grams of carbs, 38 grams of um, protein, and 2 grams of fat. So I'm going to go ahead and plug that right in. That sounds perfect. Uh, but if you didn't like that, you could continue scrolling. And it just kind of goes through all the recipes that it can find that really fit what you need. 513. So I'm going to type in here. We're going to have for dinner, AHP 513. And again, this isn't going to be perfect because I just made that up. I didn't actually look and see what I needed. But had I looked at my meal plan, I could see a better idea of what I'm looking for. So you're just going to plug that in. It's that simple. So as you can see, in a matter of minutes, now I still need a lot of calories. But again, if I wasn't on here, I could pay a little bit more attention and do it a little bit better. But um, as you can see, it takes a matter of minutes to plan out an entire day, to hit your macros, and to eat real delicious food that your entire family will enjoy, not just pulling some broccoli and some chicken and some um, asparagus. So I hope this helped you guys out. And if you're not cooking with us already, go over to ahealthypassion.com, get signed up. If you are welcome, we hope you love the software. And if there's anything I can do for you, uh, feel free to just shoot me a message. I'm always happy to help. Happy cooking, guys.